Pretty good, how are you? Good, thanks for asking. So we just got a call from the commissioners here today that uh, I guess you guys are just walking around taking some pictures. Taking some pictures, yes sir. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. So obviously if it's an open area, you guys are more than welcome to be here too. But the only issue is obviously if it's a restricted <laughs> access, which you guys can clearly see, you're yeah. not allowed to go there. So No, I know, I just get a okay. picture of your sign here. Oh, yeah. What's your name? Of course, Constable Wheatley. Yeah. Name and badge number, sir. You got a name? You have an ID with you? Oh, I most certainly do. Okay, can I see your ID, please? No, sir. No? No, okay. Have, have you been today you... now? Hey guys, this is True North Transparency. Today we're coming to you from Ottawa, Ontario, our nation's capital. And today we are at 1 Sandridge Drive at the Canadian Police College, which is this building right dead in front of us. And then the next building over, just up the way, is the RCMP station. So we're gonna, we're just going right in here today. We figured we've been having issues with the police. So that back there, way in the back, is the aviation parkway. This is the college. Oh, I forgot to mention, guys. We're here today with PC Audits. And yeah, we were we were on our way somewhere else today, but we decided not to. And so we came here instead. Yeah, so here guys, we're at the I wanna check out, make sure that I don't have smudges on my lens. This is the Canadian Police College campus. I'm just going to adjust my camera, sorry guys. Pretty good, how are you? Can I ask what you're doing? Filming. Filming for just filming. Just filming. Okay. Yes, sir. Yeah. No, I just, I just had a curiosity. Yes. Yeah. You don't you don't have uh, a pass or anything else, so that's what nope. we're looking for. It's a it's not a private area, is it? No, it's, a, it's, it, it's it's a government facility, yeah. and our rules are, are we we have to ask what's going on. Ask away, yeah. sir. What's your name? Yeah. I'm Dave. Your name? Are you an instructor here? Uh, no, nope. I'm one of the administrators uh, from our headquarters. Oh, right on. Where is the headquarters? Can I? Uh, we're not gonna get into it. We're just filming today. Okay. We're walking around taking some film. We're visiting the city. We're gonna take some pictures here and at the headquarters. So, so that guy that just spoke to me went and told apparently the commissioners. How are you? Pardon? No, I'm not too bad. Not too bad. Uh, That's good. Just filming. Just filming for just for, for ourselves. Yeah, because this is a this is a private property with public Why is access. It, no, right? oh, that's right. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's public access. I see the dog walking signs over there for people that walk through here and stuff. Yeah, we allow that. I mean, it's a basically well public property. Because it's a school facility for police officers. Yeah. Like that. And the way the way it's been worded out to me is that it's uh, it's it, it's privately owned, but we allow public use. Privately owned access. by who? RCMP. Who, yeah, see, that's not a private entity, though, you know what I mean? Yeah. The RCMP is not a private entity. We're here filming. We're going to take some pictures of the place. But uh, the, it's not a private facility. You guys got that wrong. Uh, the RCMP oh, don't own it. It is a public area. And right. you, you do allow people to walk through here. I hear there's a musical ride somewhere near here as well. Yep. Yeah. It's a nice neighborhood, that's, man. That's where they keep the horses and stuff like that. So. Yeah, and that backs onto the parkway as well, doesn't it? Yeah, sure. Is that the Aviation Parkway? Back there, yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna have to find. I'm gonna have to find out if you're allowed to be on site. Well, we'll be here. You yeah. can go find out from whoever you want. So. 
Okay. Oh, I'm sure we're allowed here. You got public access. We're absolutely okay. allowed to be here and take pictures. Can I get your name? No, I'm not giving my name. All right. Yeah. Okay. Is it like for YouTube channels or something like that? Is that huh? What, is that for YouTube channels or? Uh... Uh, it depends on what we're doing, right? Yeah. Right now we're taking pictures. This is the police college. Is this for just the RCMP training? For, it's, 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 yeah, it's, it's, tra it's, it's a training facility for, for, for RCMP for, for RCMP and police, uh, police entities. Right on. All right. What's your name? Moran. My name is Patrick Moran, yeah. Commissioner. Right on. All right. We do security here, so it's, uh, they, I have to ask. Yeah, yeah. All no, right. I understand you asking. Yeah. And we'll be on the property for a little while. If you want to find out, we're heading up to, that's a police station. It says no it's a station. police station. It's not a station. It's not. It's, it's, oh. a, it's, it's a. It's a. It's an educational facility. Yeah. All right. Okay. For, for, police, for, 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 for police officers. Yeah. I, yeah. I drove by that that police station okay. there, and it seemed like it was a police station, and then it said this was the college, but it's all one facility then, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You right. can I'm find gonna out. Make, I'm gonna make some phone calls to find out if you really thing. need if you really need to be on on site. Yeah. You do that. All right. Fine. We'll be here. It's. Uh, well, if you're allowed, if you're allowed public, to be on site, that's the thing. Public? It's privately owned with public access, so it's yeah, it's, it's a way. It's, okay. it's it's a yeah, it's a tricky way of saying. Yeah, we're allowing people to walk their dogs here, and so it's a tricky way of Canada uses to try yeah. and uh, say yeah. that they own who the police stations it? and stuff. Who funds its uh, college for the police? RCMP, as far as I know. Well, the, so who funds the RCMP? RCMP. Who funds the RCMP? <laughs> the, we do. So, uh, <laughs> I, I guess, I guess so yeah, what you public, then. But like I said, I'm gonna make some phone calls and we'll be around. We're not going nowhere. Okay. We're just taking yes. a tour. <laughs> so that old guy told on us right away. He went in there and he grabbed that commissioner. So yeah. that's commissioner, right? You know those guys? They're uh, federal security guards. Federal security guards? Yeah. Dude, these buildings are absolutely gorgeous. Who the hell wouldn't want to take pictures back in here? You know what I mean? And what better place to do the job that we do, guys, than at a police training facility? What a beautiful building. Man, I love that. And these two fellas down in a hole here. What are you guys fixing down there? What's that? What are you guys fixing up down here? Storm. The storm drain? So here we go guys, we got a ton of ton of officers going in for their training. And I missed them all. Shit. I was just out here taking pictures just a second ago. This building here looks like a campus, but it really isn't a campus. So there's a whole bunch of RCMP and training. Entering reception building a they all just went uh, what's the musical right i just want to get a picture at the front of this building go ahead if oh, you yeah, want right there good thumbnail i took it as a thumbnail where this, this oh hey right on oh wow like honestly who wouldn't want to Who wouldn't want to take pictures, guys? So the commissioners don't know shit about our rights, apparently. They're going to go ask. So here's RCMP, 1939. Such, it's such a beautiful place. Who the hell wouldn't want to film this? 1939. The SCT Wood Musical Ride Stables and Riding School. So you guys can read that if you want. So this is a, a musical ride and riding school. No shit, eh? There's no handle on that door. Well, this is the French version of that plot. You can see they've got the windows all foiled over for their own um, sermon.
Ottawa is some of the be most beautiful architecture I've ever seen. Right? And then you get that up there. Oh, we can't go in here. I want to get this from the other side. RCMP officer here. So this, I don't know what's back here, but apparently it's something. Such a beautiful day. How are you? Morning, sir. How are you doing today? Pretty good. How are you? Taking some pictures, yes sir. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. So obviously if it's an open area, you guys are more than welcome to be here too. But the only issue is obviously if it's a restricted <laughs> access, which you guys can clearly see, you're yeah. not allowed to go there. So No, I know, I just get okay. a picture of your sign here. Oh, yeah. What's your name? Of course. Constable Wheatley. Constable Wheatley. Yep. What's your badge? Is that your badge yeah, number? You can see it right here, 6692. Long badge yeah. number. Nothing unusual. Yeah, man, for sure. 100 percent So at the end of the day, obviously, if it's, you can see right there, if your camera's point over, you can see it's a restricted access area. So you guys aren't uh, allowed there. But beyond that, I mean, this is a musical ride. So obviously, if you want to take a picture of uh, the picture there with the horse, violence. Where is the musical ride? Is it in that building? So the kind permission of the Commissioner of the Royal Canadian Mounted Police, Brenda Lucky, the Royal Agricultural Winter Fair takes great pleasure in presenting the RCMP musical ride. The horses of the musical ride are bred and raised at the RCMP Breeding Farm in Pakenham, Ontario. Careful pairings of broodmares and stallions producing the black horses suitable for the musical ride purposes. Again, watching the center of the arena, let's enjoy the wagon wheel. It's restricted access yeah. area, so. Where do they keep the horses around here? Is it back in that section? You know what, I'm not too sure. Okay, because yeah, you can see it from the parkway side, but not this side. Okay, so, so is that what you guys are doing here today then? Taking pictures, yeah, man. Okay. He's got a different colored shirt. Does that mean he's yeah. a little higher rank than you? No? Not necessarily. No, no he said not necessarily. <laughs> so yeah, beyond that, I mean, if you guys want to be in an area that's open, more than welcome to take pictures. Awesome. No issue with that. No one's going to give you a hard right on. time. Obviously, just once it gets to an area that's restricted, you guys aren't allowed to be there. Obviously, the sign of force is that. Yeah. So oh, absolutely. Yeah. So we wouldn't yeah, we dream of going by that. No, we we'd be asking that. for trouble. Hey, what's your name and badge number? Well, I'm Andrew Briscoe. I'm one of the ride members. Briscoe? Right on. Okay. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah. You have a badge number, too? Uh, you can find my picture on the internet. Briscoe. Briscoe. You, you can what give me you your badge I'm number. With the musical ride. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. What, you don't have a badge number or you just don't oh, want I to have tell a badge me? Number. Oh, may I have it, please? I'm being nice. So, Ontario Police Act. Now they fall under it. It's your yeah, RCMP, you guys but fall under it, so just you should have you it have displayed. Three pieces. Yeah. So I mean, your you know, uh, police services, like your badge number and your name. Yeah. Now we good. see your name. You didn't have to tell us, but we can't see your uh, badge number. So. And uh, you could have other cops with your last name too. I'm, That's I'm not, a, I know. Yeah, I'm not we're asking just you asking your badge number. Right? He was professional yeah. enough to give it to us. We're just wondering if you'd be professional enough to give it to us. I'm not, I'm not bothering you guys, right? No, so, we, we're so not you bothering deal? you guys. Well, I, I don't feel like sharing that. You don't like, you don't feel like sharing that? Even if, even though it's your policy t-shirt? Where in RCMP policy does it say that I'm required to share that? Police act, so. Actually, I think all police are required to share a hey, name and badge number. So this is an article I found from CBC the Propaganda News Network of Canada, 
But even they were saying that the RCMP are refusing to give batch numbers of officers because they figure people are going to retaliate violently against them. And to make it all stick, they said they were concerned over far-right extremists getting this information, which is basically anybody who was unvaccinated. And the Freedom Convoy is a big thing. Uh, it's something I didn't cover. It was before the time I started my YouTube page, but it is incredible. We're just here. We're yeah, yeah, I, I know. You yeah. guys, you're Canadian citizens. Yeah, you guys, you're expressing your right to come out here. Who, who do you if, work if, for? If, if you guys, do you I, work I for, work the, for the RCMP? So say, 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 I wanted to put a complaint in on you. Uh, no, I don't want to. You can take I, my name. I, you I got your name, name, but that could be. You can have I'm the only Andrew Briscoe. There. I'm the only Andrew. Oh, you're Briscoe the only guy there, so you're not going to give us your badge number. P7419 is his radio thing. <laughs> like, uh, do I have to call in to get it? Listen. Because maybe I put a complaint in now before you're if not you allowed to call on your you can, go, you can go ahead and call in if you want. Hey, hey, guys, but you're free, to, you're free to go wherever. Right? Yeah. Holy crap. And we're free to ask. That's coming in, huh? Yeah. Another RCMP. See, it sort of gets a little. I like identifying people, especially when it turns into something a little more than it should. Like you, you're, you're great, man. But now there's more and more people coming. Yeah. So this guy, who will not identify, badge five nine one three seven, we believe, is a police officer called Eric Dubois, and this is not his first time on social media doing something he shouldn't be doing. Oh. I have created the sex offender registry that you should be a part of. You should have to register as a sex offender. You are a sex offender. You should have to register as one. That, that, that's enough, that's enough, that's enough. Excuse me. Please stop my pass. Excuse me. Get stopped my Get out stop of my pass. Excuse me, are we being detained? Are we being detained and if so why? Am I, detained? Am I being detained? Get Am I being detained, sir? Am I being detained? Am I being detained? What's your badge number? What's your name? Am I being detained? I need your name and badge number. You just put hands all over a woman. You gave no command. You impeded our progress. What is your name? You're a coward. You are an absolute coward. You have your government goose put hands on a woman. Come on, move. Mr. Trudeau. Move. move. You put hands on move. me again under move. one off. Disturbing the mom. peace, you spy me. I am not disturbing the peace. Yes, you're disturbing you, the peace, so move away. Excuse me, sir. I, move. You I have not been disturbed. You are disturbing moved. the peace, so move. I have moved. What is your name? Come on. What is your name? Trudeau, move. your henchmen are putting hands all, right, all over women. Come on. Stop screaming like that. Hey, we're allowed to protest. Are you going to be arrested? I am not. You're not moved. protesting. You're disturbing the peace by I screaming am not. and yelling. You cannot be okay. detained in a... Excuse me, can you get this guy away from you? Do you want to be arrested? I'm stepping back. Step down. I am. Stop screaming. Well, I'll do that. And can I please have your name? I need his name, please, and card. He put hands all over this woman over there and on me. I need his card. He gave no lawful commands. He gave no instructions. He went hands on a woman repeatedly. Repeatedly. Get Holy you. jumping. Defy yourself, sir. There's his plate, there's his car number, here's his partner. Can you identify yourselves? Will you identify yourselves? This goon protecting Trudeau just threatened to arrest me repeatedly. Repeatedly. This fucking goon. Name and badge number, sir. You got a name? You have an ID with you? Oh, I most certainly do. Okay, can I see your ID, please? No, sir. No? No, okay. Have you been you, have you now? So what's really important to note right here is he just detained me. He says, you're being detained now. And in a quick second, his partner is going to grab his attention. So he's going to look to the left of the screen. And his partner, Constable Wheatley, is going to tell him they didn't do anything wrong. They didn't go in any restricted areas or anything. And this tyrant is going to continue to push the issue continue to escalate and he is still going to tell me that he suspects I have committed a crime even after Constable Wheatley told him I did not enter the restricted area. Let's keep watching. Have you uh, have you suspected me of 
Yeah. You, you suspect me of committing any crime? Have they been there? No. They're, they're on that side of the line. Actually, it's okay. Just, yeah. Guy, We're just taking pictures. pictures. Yeah. yeah. So what's your name? Five nine one three seven is your badge. But what's your yeah. name? You have my badge? What's your name? That's fine. See, you guys are really bad. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Wait, you, you agree with it, eh? Yeah, yeah. No, you yeah. totally look like a yeah. tyrant. Yeah. 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 Sorry, man, yeah. but you do. Yeah. You said you suspect me of committing any sort of a crime? Yeah. You suspect me of committing a crime? Yeah. Yeah? What? Read his number Refusing to identify yourself. Yeah. Yeah, you have no right. You have no right to ask me for ID unless you, you suspect me of a crime, sir. You've been inside that area. I've not been inside that area. No. No. Okay. We're right. taking pictures. Says it's fine for that. But if you go in a restricted area, I'm allowed to ask you for identification. Of course you are, but we're okay. not in the restricted area. Thank you for that. So you don't have a name. You have my reg number. That's it. Yeah, and this guy, I, I don't have his name, but not his reg number. You guys are, uh, yeah, man. You guys should, you guys should learn better. I think okay. you should. We're okay. here taking pictures. Yeah. And tried to grab his uh, the, camera right away. The youngest guy. You didn't even know what was going on. That guy already, uh, that cop had to tell you, hey, they didn't go back there. But you were ready to go hands on. You're the tyrants. Is Did I touch here. anyone? You were the tyrant. Yes, uh, yes, you're yes. You're the reason why we're out here. Yeah, okay, you're good for tyrant. you. Good for you. You're you know his the name? one that's probably teaching no, these I, young guys said, to the tyrant people. I'm never going to stay here. Yeah, now. okay. So. I was just taking a picture of the sign here, and then you you don't want to uh, give me a name, but you give me a badge because number. It's, it's kind of a similar thing. But you don't want to identify yourself. But we have a right not to. What, the, we have. A, we, we've already given you. No, an you haven't. It's to always two pieces us. with the police. It's always two pieces. If there's another Briscoe, we're in trouble. Now there's we can't find out who is here. And you know what? I was cool. I was cool with this guy coming out and just shooting the shit with us. Tell your guy it's okay. We know how to do this. You guys can leave. You guys can leave. What's your rank? I can't see it on your it's, uniform. Uh, we know we're all right doing this. No, we're not. We're not hurting nothing. Just checking so your shoulders. You guys, kill you, not us. you guys are edging this off by standing here. And I don't understand you your attitude. I remember you on Parliament Hill. Huh? I remember you on Parliament Hill. From when? Eh, the convoy. You don't remember me from anywhere. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. No, sir. Ah. Your face looks familiar to me. Does it? Yeah. I have a familiar face. I don't Right after that, the 49-year-old woman who uses a walker was run over by Toronto Police Service's horses that rolled through the crowd. Onlookers were heard yelling at police to stop. Stand down. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Look what you did! Look what you did to her! Any of you guys cameras? <laughs> yeah. So I was visiting the neighborhood, stopped in to see the park. That's good. Yeah. That's good. Of course I do, but I'm not. I'm not identifying until you tell me a crime that I've committed, which there is no crime. You understand that? I've, this I've, this I've, this I've fellow doesn't. I want the car number. There's no car number. Yeah. Main citizen, you have the right to be here if you'd like. Yeah. You obviously understand. You've been super good with me. These two, I, I didn't much. It was too much, man. You know, you came out to make contact, so, and I'm, I'm actually very pleased with, so, with your behavior. Okay. And, you know, I understand you guys asking questions, but this guy coming up and being, uh, oh, look. See, that that's 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 a little above and beyond, you understand. So, I'm just going to circle back to what we're talking about here. We don't need to spin our tires. You know, you've already told me you've reported here. You know you're not allowed to go under restricted tires. Absolutely. Area. If you want to go around the Staples, can it to here just site? Very nice area here. You're it is. To it's beautiful. And okay. I understand it is public access. So, so, so yeah. beyond that, I'm going to take off. Do you have any questions or concerns for me? No, man. Okay. No, just uh, yeah. maybe stay until one of these guys leaves because so, I think this guy's you, you know uh, a little what? I, 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 jumpy. I, honestly, yeah. honestly, I think we're all going to take off here. Oh, that's great. Right? So I hope so. You, you let me know you're not going to go under restricted that's access that's here. That's why I'm letting him know. Yeah. And why is this guy? Is that is that his personal phone? You guys all have issued phones. Is that a work phone? Yeah, see, that's that's you know, weird. If you don't have any further questions or concerns, I'll I'll reiterate the same thing to your partner. Yeah, yeah. 
No car number, no nothing. Big ass gun. Big ass tyrant. Thanks, man. Appreciate you. Have a great day. Uh, just want to let you know that we're going to be taking off as well. Please reiterate to me, you guys haven't reported that you know your knowledge about it, which is the access yeah. to area. Beyond that, if it's open to the public, you're a Canadian citizen, you want to take a Now, here, here's a question I do have. What, can you, uh, so. if, if you weren't a Canadian citizen, you're going to go back to this Okay. Why, why is the line here, but the signs are back there? I have trouble reading too from a distance. So is this, would this line be the restricted access line or is it the signs? The, the sign says no public access. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I was just wondering why the signs are about 30 feet back. I, I don't see very well anymore. So. Right on. Stay safe out there. Okay. You too. Okay. Oh, yeah. I've got no issues with that. COVID time. Okay, so we're gonna take off beyond that. At least you came out, you were uh, you're a gentleman, you're a professional, you fucking gave your Listen. name and your name, uh, badge number. These guys, that guy come hey, out. He was a little hot, man, that guy. Him right off the hop, guys, I couldn't believe that. You know, anyway, we're not we're here to talk about that. Yeah. We're just trying to do our job. That's cool, yeah. okay? Well, the camera right, guys. Just we can keep see doing it. it your way. Yeah, you, you did a good <laughs> job. So it's a yellow line, it's not the signs, dude. Is oh, what yeah, they're, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, if, if, if it says no public access, there. I would oh, just for future reference, if this is it is publicly accessible area for future reference, I'd move them a little closer. Again, like I, I have trouble reading from a distance, okay. well, so but that's all. The, the yellow, yeah, kind of, kind of like when you're driving, you're not supposed to cross yellow lines, right? So well, we're not driving. Yeah. <laughs> bring your attention to something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's all right. good. No, man. All good. The law says behind the sign. Anywhere, anywhere behind the sign. Yeah. Well, it also says here no public access. Yeah, right? I, I didn't, I didn't read that. So. CDZM two five two. This guy. CDZM two five two. It is. That's what we're doing today. It's a beautiful day too. Yeah, Who the hell wouldn't want to be in here looking at this? Your badge number. If you want, if you want, you can make a complaint. My name's. Oh, I don't want to, man. There's no, there's no sense for that. I want to see you guys. Yeah, you too. Guys, we're at the RCMP headquarters. Not the RCMP headquarters. Sorry, I keep thinking that's what this was. But we are at the Canadian Police College, and we can see what they're doing here. They're training the next generation very poorly. Uh, the young guy was great, but the uh, two older fellows were kind of jerks, to be very honest with you. Uh, the guy with the... The guy that came up and I guess he tried to grab my camera, or was about to, until he realized he was still on film and his buddy turned his... Uh, his buddy told him no. <laughs> that was... Um, that guy is quite the tyrant. I had a feeling like I was going to jail or at least gonna get assaulted by the man. But guys, this is what they're, this is where they're teaching the RCMP, so you see where they get it. The administrator that we ran into ran and told the commissioners. The commissioners went and called the other police, and now the police have arrived. And, um, and uh, yeah, they basically escalated the situation more than it needed to be. Never needs to be escalated, even in the slightest bit. And then he whipped out his personal phone and started taking pictures of us. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking smart ass over here. I have, a, I have a method to my madness here, bro. I was just taking a panoramic shot. I'm gonna take a circle, a panoramic view. I don't know what area we're in. We're at the very edge of... Uh, Rockcliffe, which is like the richest neighborhood um, in in Ottawa, and these I think these guys are they're not great. That's the first run-in I've had with RCMP since the Yukon, and they weren't that great in the Yukon either. So, anyways, guys, this is True North Transparency. We're gonna take off and head on out of here. And we're going to the next place here in Ottawa. See you soon.